My name is Talal Marvani, a teacher of Photo of the English uh, for grade 11 uh, for the school uh, Hamad bin Abdullah Independent Secondary School. Uh, on behalf of uh, grade 11 uh, teachers, I want just to present argumentative or how to write a simple argumentative essay. First, we have to consider what does it mean the word argumentative before starting to write argumentative essay. First, argument, argumentative is what is debatable views and opinions about how can you write well and organize essay expressing views of your own or not on a specific topic that you choose or sometimes is you are required to write in what they say. How to write a simple argumentative essay? First, we have to consider about some points, okay? And the points are, think about your topic. If you need just want to consider about the topic, okay, you have to take notes. How can you start your introduction? How can you organize your ideas? How can you express the linking devices which consolidate and cons construct your essay? Make a very short outline with short points. That means it's very important and it's vital to make or jot down some points that may you consider in writing your paragraphs of the argumentative essay. Make sure you argue with yourself. That means what are the points that you are going to explain for the reader. Okay? And what are the different views that may come across in writing argumentative essay. Don't use modern verbs like could or would or might. Be sure of what of your ideas. So we need just want to focus on the second point, make sure very short outline is what with short points. Why? Just because if you need just want to write, you have to be aware of what of not using modern verbs like that. Use linking words like but and however and although all these linking devices expressing the other sides of what of the argument. Use paragraphs with an introduction, a body and conclusion, and I think this is the outline of what of how can you write an argumentative essay correctly. So the questions that may come across. Discuss the positive and negative effects of living in the city. Include positive things about living in the city, negative things about living in the city, and your opinion. So, your opinion, it should be as an independent paragraph. Sometimes, if you need just what to write an argumentative essay, you have to put a plan, okay, in your mind, and then take a piece of paper and a pen and then starting jotting down your ideas. So, the question is that, is it better to live in the countryside or the city? Introduction. So the planning should be like that. Arguments for what the points that you agree about living in what? In the countryside or the city. And what are the arguments against what you write here? Sometimes you need, in what in each paragraph, examples are not and justifications. Example and justification, even in what in argument, arguments against. And in the last one, conclusion, that it could be the last paragraph for your essay. So, the question in what in the exam, 
It would be like that. Situation and task. Some people argue that living in the countryside is better than living in a city. To what extent do you agree or not? So the task, write an argumentative essay, provide clear arguments and clear details. So let us just show you what is the model here as an introduction. Firstly, some people like quiet areas like villages and the countryside, but you always find the best facilities in the city. People who have children need to live near hospitals and schools and places like nurseries and shopping centers so they can be there in a short time. Although these places make cities busier, they also make life much easier for most people. So, you have to draw your introduction like that. Secondly, and however, we put it just one in a different color, just to show you how can you use the linking words and the linking devices in the paragraphs. Secondly, and most of what of the students actually have absolute knowledge of what of using commas after the linking words. So secondly, it should be a comma here. Most factories and offices are in the city and people who work in them need to travel. It's much easier for people if they live near where they work so they don't have to travel a long way. So, I mean in the first and in the second paragraphs, that means you are separating the arguments for. So, how can you present the other sides of what of the argument when we say, however, that means I'm going to express ideas which is different totally for what has been mentioned above. However, there are many people, especially in the UK, and UK well known is abbreviated for United Kingdom, who love the peace and quiet of the countryside and prefer to travel a long way to, go, to get to work. On the other hand, it means as a second linking device for suppressing contrasting ideas. I live in a very multicultural Multicultural, what does it mean? It means to live in a cosmopolitan area or a city which uh, cultures or thought of people different from one to other. Where there are lots of people from many different countries. So this, it could be another meaning for what for the word cosmopolitan, for the word multicultural. There are shops, restaurants and bars to visit as well as cinemas and theatres. Life is the city, is much more active and vibrant than life in the country. So, in what, how can you draw your, what your conclusion? It's very important that there are some expressions made, written in concluding paragraphs, like the word in conclusion, or sometimes finally, or sometimes all in all. All these expressions can be used in what in conclusion. For example, it's much better to live in a city because there are more facilities, more job opportunities, and more entertainment. So, sometimes it's very important to have and to know about the words that you are going to use inside your argumentative essay. And you have to use a strong and effective words just 
to grasp your reader's attention. Like, for example, facilities, opportunities, entertainment, okay? That means all these words should be used just to consolidate your argumentative essay. If I get permission to stay in the UK, I will move to Lincoln. So, all these consider as what? As expressing, you know, opinions and ideas for, for the argumentative essay. Okay. Okay, now what I need just what to draw finally. It's very important, that means if you need to write it, you have to aware of what of these points. Thank you very much and goodbye.